All right, I decided to start doing hip because I wanna lean out a little bit for summer. I wanna show you guys what's possible. And I bought this treadmill off of a local buy, sell Facebook marketplace actually. And it's like a $2,500 treadmill that I got for 500 bucks. So these things are super affordable. Lots of people hang clothes on them all the time. I was guilty of doing that. I had a few of these over the years, but this thing I've been using it every day and I've been doing hit because hit is when, and you know, you can start out just slowly, run for a minute or run for as long as you can and then walk for the same time. And so I've worked my way up to three minutes each. There's a few different reasons why I'm doing this. Hit high intensity interval training is really good for burning fat because after you do a HIT workout, you burn calories, you burn fat. Some people say up to 48 hours after you've done the HIT thing. The science shows a few different things. Regardless of what it is, you're gonna burn calories after it. And it's one of the most effective ways to lose belly fat. Now, the other reason I'm doing it is because Peter Atia talks about your VO2 max and this is basically your oxygen utilization and that's a great way he does four minutes but like when they run I'm just kind of going at a jog right now because my cardio isn't where it needs to be but when they run it's like full out so it's barn burner when you're actually doing a VO2 max and you have that thing in your mouth and they're measuring how much oxygen you're using you are running as going as hard as you can and so I'm trying to do this once a week now just because I haven't been doing this for a long time and I'm 52 I I'm basically at a jog for three minutes now and I go three minutes on, three minutes off and I do four rounds. You know, I'm pretty tired after that. So I'll work my way to four minutes. I'll work my way to running at full steam. But for now, I give HIT a try because it's really good for burning fat. Like I said, you're gonna burn it for hours after the workout and just start out with a minute, a minute or 30 seconds in a minute or you can even run for the 30 seconds or fast walk or whatever physical fitness is at and then you can walk for the recovery time so your heart rate and your breath is back and you catch your breath, right? So just be careful with it because, you know, when you're first starting, I know even me, it was a little tricky even running on the treadmill, but now I can run for three minutes and I feel great. Give it a try, guys.